Thank you so much for taking your moments to join me here today for Today I Choose. Today I want to approach the, the concept of the watchers. You know, I think that many times in our silence, we, we don't understand, right, that we're actually supporting the harm, right? That's not a thought we have. And, you know, I liken it to like if you were um, the driver of the car and your friends went in and robbed a bank and you knew it was happening, you're an accomplice. So if we're in a space of allowance and excuses around, you know, people that we love's behavior, Are we not an accomplice, right? I know how often, right, as a kid, I would hear, well, you know, that's just your dad. That's how he is. Or, oh, well, you know, uncle so-and-so, you better walk a big circle around him, right? And there was this knowingness around these behaviors. And rather than addressing the behavior, right, If we were, if it was showing up anywhere at all that the, that that was being addressed, it was in a state of like, uh, right? So we have to understand that, right? If we are with someone that we are witnessing harm being done to your children, your friends, your parents, your family, right? And you're allowing it, you're an accomplice. And I think that is a place for us as victims to shift, right? If in your silence, you're not supporting the person who is being harmed. There is a level of being an accomplice, right? So in our family structures, in this change we need to see for the organs of this body of our collective humanity to change, we, that we need to recognize that, right? And we need to understand that um, being a watcher causes just as much harm, almost more, right? Because I can remember looking back and thinking, huh, you knew. You knew that was happening and left me to fight that on my own. Right. Or, you know, I knew that so-and-so was, you know, being a bully. And instead of addressing the behaviors of the bully, we're telling the other child how to avoid the situation. Right. There's no authority there. There's no personal respect there. Right? And there's no accountability there. Right? So, as we step into this humongous gateway of change and dip our toes further into the age of Aquarius, um, the age of reason, right? Um, these realizations will bring this body of the collective into balance, into justice, as we've been speaking of. So um, if you are a watcher, think about the consequences of that and think about how you can um, step away 
or step into authority in those situations and diffuse them, whatever needs to happen. At least recognize, right? And if you're trying to distinguish the environment, right? Understanding the levity of the, of the watcher is really an important place when we move into trying to walk out of the maze of confusion that, that these um, behaviors has, have caused. Right? So wake up watchers, right? Wake up watchers. Because we on the outside looking in can bring a space of objectivity to those situations, right? So have a great day. And please, if this resonates, hop over on my YouTube and like me here on Facebook and like, let's hang out, right? Linking arms is going to be the change that is um, going to revolutionize humanity.